It is a problem really across the country, but it's especially bad in Tennessee. People pointing lasers at airplanes. It's happened more than 400 times in the volunteer state so far this year, according to data from the Federal Aviation Administration. Now, state cap reporter Tori Gesner explains the impact this is having on pilots and the harsh punishment for breaking the federal law. At Middle Tennessee State University's Department of Aerospace, pilot instructors teach safety in the skies. But there's one element on the ground that can turn the skies into a high-stakes light show. All of a sudden, the cockpit is illuminated very dramatically, and it can be kind of like a flashing, strobing sensation. They're lasers. Pointing one at a plane can put pilots and their passengers in danger. At the very least, a distraction. And of course, there are some more severe consequences, too, like actual harm to people's eyes. Um, some people have actually been injured before by laser strikes. There's someone down there shooting a green laser. There have been 404 laser strikes on aircrafts in Tennessee so far this year, according to data from the Federal Aviation Administration. After crunching the numbers, we found Tennessee ranked third in the country for the most strikes last month alone. Metro Nashville police pilot Matt Harris describes what it's like to be blinded by the beam. Imagine being at night and get hit with a bright light right in the eyes. You realize you can't see anything for, for a few minutes driving down the road or whatever. Well, in an aircraft, you could hit another aircraft, you could hit a tower, you could hit the ground. There's all kinds of different scenarios where if you can't see, you can't do your job. Serious consequences, not just for those in the laser's path, but also those behind it. The punishment, an up to $250,000 fine and five years in prison. Especially since it's a, a violation of federal law, I'm not really sure why anyone would would attempt it. Reporting in Nashville, I'm Tori Gessner. We should also mention so far this year, there have been almost 7,000 laser strikes across the country, according to the FAA. Last year, there were more than 13,000, the most ever reported.